guys! Welcome back to Karamea's Corner. In today's Easter pocket letter, we're gonna use the Target Dollar Spot Easter stickers. We're also gonna use our Easter stationery for our pocket letter itself. And we're also gonna use our paper treat sack. You're also gonna need a nine trading card pocket holder card holder. This one I got from the dollar store for a set of 10 and you got the plastic nine card sheet holder. We're also going to use some scrapbooking paper that I got from Michaels. Um, we're going to use the bright yellow green colors and some polka dot print for our background. We're going to need nine of those and they'll be measuring three and a half by two and a half inches. Now that we've cut out our nine pocket letter cards, we're going to go ahead and embellish them with stickers. So we'll start with our first card. I'm going to embellish it with a bunny and the word hop in. For our next card, since I don't have Easter stamps, I went ahead and typed in the Easter egg hunt word on an orange sheet. I'm going to use my craft scissors and cut that out and I'm going to stick it on the card and embellish it. For the third card, I embellished it with two bunny stickers and an arrow cut out saying this way. And what good is an Easter egg hunt without eggs to look for? So we're going to hide a couple of these eggs in one of these pockets.
So there you have all nine cards filled out. Don't forget, we had two of the Easter eggs for a little Easter egg hunt. And now it's time to put our treats. For our Easter pocket letter goodies, we're going to put in some of these huge bunny page flags. I found them at Daiso for $1.50. We're also going to include some colorful neon markers. That's from the Target dollar spot. And we also have these spring-themed clothespins from Michaels. And since spring is in the air, we're going to include some buttons, colorful buttons that I'm going to put in these little pouches to hold them in place in our pockets. We're using our dollar spot bunny paper or stationery for our pocket letter. So I went ahead and wrote a little note for our friend and gave him a few clues to where our uh, mystery Easter eggs are at. And I went ahead and sealed it with our remaining stickers. And we're going to put that right here at the bottom slot. So let's have a look and make sure we have everything we need in our pocket letter. We got the nine cards. It says hop in, Easter egg hunt this way. And we have all these cute little critters excited to do their Easter egg hunt. And in the back, we have our treats, our dice, so page flags, the bunny ones, some embellishments, sticky notes, some floral buttons, our spring themed clothespin, polka dot page flag, our critter highlighters in orange and yellow, and finally our pocket letter. So here you see our finished Easter basket. We see the little chick, the bunny, we used our pipe wires to make the handles, and I also finished both sides to give it a more finished look using some glittery foam paper. So this will be holding our Easter pocket letter. Isn't that cute? And now we're gonna show you how to put it in our Easter basket. Let's fold it up. I'm gonna fold this around it. And to hold it in place and keep it secure, I found these really cute Easter egg clothespins from the Target dollar spot, a set of three. For a dollar. So we're going to hold that in place on one side and put the other one on this side. If you have a chalk marker, you can write the message you like, Happy Easter. So there you have it. Thanks again for watching Karamea's Corner. Make sure to check out our previous pocket letter videos and Target hauls. See you next time. Bye!